Campaigners are urging shampoo and liquid soap manufacturers to stop using a chemical that's been linked to cancer. A group in the US is suing four major companies for failing to warn consumers about the risks of exposure to Cocomid DEA. Jane Luscom reports. When most people wash their hair, it's cleanliness, not cancer, on their minds. But there's growing concern about the chemicals in shampoos and liquid soaps. A lot of people, they think they've got an allergy, and all they're doing is they're getting irritated by the chemicals, the everyday chemicals they've got on their hands. Malcolm Rands, a campaigner against toxic chemicals, wasn't surprised when the Centre for Environmental Health, or CEH, in California began a lawsuit against four companies. They're accused of using cocamide DEA in body products without warnings. Cocomide DEA is used to make products foam, but the state of California's officially listed it as a chemical known to cause cancer in animals. Michael Green from the CEH said, most people believe that products sold in major stores are tested for safety, but consumers need to know that they could be doused with a cancer-causing chemical every time they shower or shampoo. It is now banned in, in parts of the world and I cannot see why it shouldn't be banned here. Rand says New Zealand has very light regulations. Body products must contain a list of ingredients, but in California they must also carry a warning if they contain anything carcinogenic. The CEH has said it intends suing more than 100 other companies that make or sell products containing cocomide DEA. The US FDA, which is responsible for public health, has told consumers not to be alarmed, but it's also advised people who are concerned to check the product labels. Jane Luscombe, 3 News.